Welcome. This is the roast of uh, Mr. Jared Pegg. I am your host, Daniel Alvarez, aka PQQP, aka Dad. Hope you guys are enjoying the party. It's been a while since I've seen some of you. I can't wait. Probably, uh, you know, Fort Rapids or something. But, uh, yes. Well, start things off. I'll say Merry Christmas. I actually, I should probably say Happy Holidays since I know Link's there. You know, Shalom, dude. But, and don't get mad. You know, it's, it's, it's just a thing. I mean, I've seen you mad. I mean, I've even seen Derek Vogan tell you not to punch the wall. So that's when you know you're, you're kind of mad. <laughs> but uh, let's see here. All right, Jared. I love Jared. I love Jared. But, uh, you know, if I had his standards, which, you know, I would probably uh, go for a 16-year-old as well. I mean, you know, in Seattle. Well, that's of course where they're taping uh, to catch a predator the last couple months. So, I, I I was on to you, Jared. I was on to you. And you know, but if I got my genes, you know, if you get your genes from your parents, and I now was you, I would probably stop deal hunting. Yeah, probably be a good idea. And, uh, yeah. Um, but, uh, I was going to say, you know, sorry, I look, uh, you know, well, actually, I look kind of good. <laughs> but, uh, you know, sorry, I, I took a shower and uh, just got out of work because uh, some of us do those things. So, you know, I had to get prepared for this. So, um, but I figured out why you like hockey. And, I mean, it's cool, you know, it's a great sport <laughs> if you like dudes, but um, I, I totally figured it out. And it's because it relates so much to you, you know. They all got the same crazy haircut, you know, the forbidden hair chopped up like a damn, I don't know. But, uh, no, it's they, they have your, your haircut, you know. Um, it's all male players, of course, I mean, obviously. <laughs> and... You know, it's really hard for you to score, so I figure it's a perfect game. And, um, oh, ooh, I do have a phone call. Hold on. That would be Mike. This would be Necro Lemur. Let's see what he wants. I'm just kidding. Actually, it was, it was nobody. Uh, they wanted their hair back, so. Yeah. Oh, no, it really was Mike. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'm in the middle of a roast, so I'll do it afterwards. I we're a, oh, okay, all right. Okay, sounds good. All right, go fuck yourself. Okay, that was just Mike, but um, no, Jared, you uh, I love you, Jared. You're a good man. Um, you know, I was researching, and actually, I know a lot of languages, too, so, and, uh, Kiki, in, uh, common sense, means no-no, so, thought I'd tell you that, but, uh, figured you already might know. Um, but no, let's give a, you know, props to, uh, Bader for setting this one up. I miss him as well, and the lovely Courtney, of course. And, uh, well, Justin, um, I was going to wear, you know, I was going to try to be like you and wear the, um, those shirts, uh, that are like three sizes too small, which I sometimes do, but, uh, I figured I'd just go casual today. And, uh, you know, I would hate, I would, I would hate to have to like snort coke with you 
because that that dude you're that that nose you got man that nigga's like a vacuum dog you know you just I, I wouldn't want to share with you I mean uh, even Jay Leno was like making fun of your nose you know I mean he thought his chin was bad but it's it's incomparable man but no really though if I were gay though I wouldn't know whether you know fuck you in the ass or your nose so go for the bigger hole, but I couldn't tell you which one that was, so, you know, I don't know, but, uh, no, thanks for hosting this for us, this was a really good idea, and, uh, you know, just maybe you'll get laid, I don't know, good for you, I don't know how dumb Courtney is, but you might, you might get laid, um, and, uh, you know, shout out to other people there, other 16-year-olds like Zach Bader and, um, and Zach Bader. So, um, and, uh, but yeah, uh, one man I would like to point out is Andy Walker. I miss him. I miss that chrome dome motherfucker. I'll tell you that much. He, he's, he's a good man. I mean, looking at his head, you know, makes me want to go home and, well, I am home and, you know, clean my dildo and see, you know, I mean, that thing is good. I'm not going to lie. And yes, I do own a dildo, so you can go fuck yourself. It's green with the Yoshi imprint on it. But, uh, no, really, Andy, I miss you and, uh, you know, you're like Jay-Z, you know, you got 99 problems, uh, but actually probably most of them, you know, have to do with your hair or girls, so, so that doesn't really work, but I don't know. Um, but I think that's, that's enough. I'm trying to think who else is there. Uh, well, Tom No Bar's there. But he's probably so intoxicated he doesn't realize he's there. Or he's like, you know, jerking off to like quantum mechanics or some shit like that. Or or jerking off another dude, which is like the same thing. So, but, um, yeah, it seems like you got a pretty good crowd there. And uh, hopefully you guys have a great evening. I have to work, but uh, I would really like to be there. So thanks for being a good sport. And... Uh, I finally found out the best slogan, Steel Reserve, the official beverage of Jared Pegg and all homeless men around the world. So, but uh, Merry Christmas. I'll see you guys soon, hopefully. Thank you.